So machine translation is the process of writing algorithms uh, so that machines can then take in uh, previous examples uh, which have been produced uh, by humans, previous examples of human translations, learn from them, identify patterns, and then try to use that knowledge which has been uh, learned by the system to then translate new data which it hasn't seen before. So machine translation is just a tool that can uh, be useful to human translators to make them more efficient, to, uh, to translate faster if they have uh, very short deadlines, to improve the quality of their translation, uh, to make them more consistent, and to deal with uh, topics that perhaps they haven't dealt with before. As my view on technology is that it's going to, uh, it's going to basically help humans uh, produce better and do better, technology is going to transform the way we work completely. And it's not about comparing, because there, there will be tasks that machines will execute a lot better than humans. I mean, whether we're talking about narrow artificial intelligence or we're talking about general artificial intelligence beyond the realm of translation, uh, machines are going to surpass humans in accuracy and the ability to do things. The question here is what uh, human talent is going to do and what is going to be the biggest value of human talent in the future. And I think that the human value is going to be about what machines will struggle to replicate, which is emotional intelligence, creativity, um, customer-centric thinking. Machines will learn, I mean, machine learning is going at a pace where all of these things are going to be basically the next frontier, you know, how a machine can learn how to feel. But for now, I mean, I think that, and for the foreseeable future, that's where the human value is going to be. So I would rather see technology as an aid that human talent will have in order to work better, faster, so that we can really use the talent for those things that machines cannot replicate.